In the year 2040, one hero fights to save our dying planet, the Phantom. Security to Sean One. I found the spy from Maximum Inc. Beacon ready to launch. You! Float back from the hatch! Max here. The message cylinder is on schedule. Give me the cylinder, Max. What's the magic word? Or else. That's two words. If you want to play with me, play fair. Mother would insist. <laughs> Hypercycle, lock and find. Telling me you don't know who made you or why. So how does that make you feel? Buyouts have no feelings. Oh, you're not that kind of buyout, Heisenberg. However it happened, I think you do have feelings, don't you? I'm not certain. Well, now, that's exactly where the blues come from. From thinking about questions that might not have answers. I still do not understand you, Betty. But I'm glad you're my friend. <laughs> the feeling is mutual, man. Call the network, Pav. Phantom terrorizes city and... The Doctor is in! The Phantom's not terrorizing the city, Doctor. It's the citizen he's chasing. Oh, <laughs> you're begging to be reprogrammed again. Network on line one. The earliest memory I have is of hearing you play. Everything else is inaccessible. Betty! <laughs> Jack in the uplink of the photonics! 
had, call my agent. It could be time to renegotiate my deal. Inductance rope, catch. Heisenberg. Now give me the cylinder. Cylinder? <laughs> what cylinder? <laughs> now what's that purple pariah up to now? Why chase someone just to let him go? Maybe he didn't want the citizen. Maybe he wanted this cylinder. If the Phantom wants that, and I want it too. But since I'd attract too much attention, <laughs> that's better. Slap on a disguise and find me a private investigator. Preferably one without too much experience. Here's the newest listing. It's very quaint, Jack. But what does this all have to do with protecting the environment? Well, I intend to do my part, Eloise, to take action just like Kit for the environment, for justice, for whoever needs me. My, my great-grandfather was a detective back in the San Francisco Islands, <clears throat> before they were islands, of course. Uh, you might say it's my family's destiny. Don't talk about family destiny to me. My father, my brother, now even my nephew is a phantom. Will it never end, Jack? If you go through with this, you're only asking for trouble. Eloise, is that is that you? Detective Archer. At your at your service, Ms. I wish you to locate a missing Biot for me. A uh, Biot? He is a most unusual Biot. You must locate him and his organic companion at once. I told you Dr. Jack saw me put the cylinder in the saxophone case. That's his biot assistant up there. I've seen her on his show. For once, kid, you did the right thing. He doesn't know it yet, but Detective Archer just started working for Maximum Inc. It's a photonic memory core, all right. And if we even try to read it without the right code key, we'll erase the dead inside forever. Maybe that's what happened to your memories, Heisenberg. But how did such a thing come to be in your saxophone case? Probably something to do with that crazy hypercycle chase last night. And that guy in the purple you told me about. He's gotta be the Phantom. I heard he was back. Who is the Phantom? Someone who fights battles that some say can't be won. Like the blues are about questions that might not have answers. I say he's a hero just for trying. So he is an expert at recovering inaccessible data? Honey, from the stories I heard, he's an expert in everything. Do you know where this phantom can be found? Wherever there's a jungle, sugar. I can sell you five minutes of tropical beach. No pollution. I, I was gonna buy some food. It's pre-resource wars. Oh. All right, Jack me in. Oh. oh, it is so beautiful. Huh, you mean it was. <laughs> So what'll it be, pal? A little taste of the Great Barrier Reef? Actually, I'm just looking for this biot. You ever come in here? What for? You need feelings to jack into what I sell. Uh, wait just a pay. Come on, that wasn't five minutes. I'll blame the core dump with the hat. I shouldn't have unplugged me, citizen. I need my virtual. Maybe someday you won't. Come on, let's check out the real world. What are you after, sir? Kid? That's what I was going to say, Professor. What are you doing here? Well, I was looking for... <gasps> That's Maximum's fractal biot. I'm looking for it, too. It... 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 it, it is? It, you are? You remember? 
It can change its shape, has a remote control brain and a case it has to carry. I believe it's connected to a data cylinder Max Madison hid somewhere last night when I was chasing him. I didn't see the fractal at the time, but the cameras on my hypercycle did. My word. And, and I was hired to find him by, by another biot. A, a, a biot in red, actually. Mm -hmm. I think you better start at the beginning, Professor. A thing of beauty is a joy for him. Look, Becky, if you're gonna make me an offer, make me an offer! Oh, I like getting input, even from you. Excuse us, please, citizen. Detective Archer wants to see me again. Were you about to take a bribe from that woman? Why not? Think of the ratings when I expose her. I think you crossed my wires, Pab. I keep tasting French horns and hearing orange. Well, what is that disgusting creature saying now? The detective wants another meeting. Then let's make it one to remember. Detective Archer, it's late. I must go home and recharge. Uh, no, really, I insist. You you must wait and talk to my associate. He, he's never late. He's... That, that's odd. Where did this come from? Ah! That must be him now. Uh, it's open, Kit. Don't bother to... Knock. I want the fiat. You do not meet acceptable standards for an artificial life form. I'm going to call... You're going to have a rather bad case of random bit error. <coughs> Baudelaire says we should take the detective, too. <coughs> <gasps> Professor Archer, I should have never let you... Phantom? What are you doing there? What have you done to Professor Archer? Nothing. Yet. But only because I didn't know he was your friend. So if you don't turn over the message cylinder, I'll personally donate him to the Maximum Organ Bank. Piece by piece. I don't have the cylinder. Then you have ten hours to find it. You'll get instructions for contacting me. And I thought the university was tough. Aim. Lock. No. We must not fight. We must help each other find answers. I have one for you. I know where the cylinder is. This is the same one I saw Max Madison retrieve. What makes it so important? We've got nine hours left to break its data key code and see what's inside. Ask me then. As you wish. But now we must deactivate the fractal biot. It might still be working for Maximum. No, no, no. I've talked to him, Garan. He's lost whatever programming Max gave him. He doesn't remember what he used to be. It is a machine, Phantom. But what if he's a new kind of machine? He seems self-aware, almost as if he's alive. We're taking the cylinder to a place where we can break its code. But you will return, so we can trade the cylinder for Graf's two prisoners. Of course he will, honey. He's the Phantom. Good. I am quite concerned for her safety. Her safety? Her name is Pavlova. I have never seen such engineering. You don't even know if the cylinder still exists, so how can you be sure the Phantom will find it and walk into your trap, even if the old fool is his friend? I don't have to. The Bayat's got a friend, too. And he'll set up the Phantom any way I tell him to. Look who's working for Maximum now. For free. Wow. What do I say, Metropia? I say things are looking up, and Cyberville is as up as they get. And if anyone knows what's up, I do. So if a certain Lavender listener out there wants to know what I know about a shut-in friend, hey, I'm only a phone circuit away. He means you, Kit. Graf must have some kind of hold over him. Hey, you bits! I skated the lockout from an off-site heap zone all by myself. Could you please repeat that in a language with which we are all familiar? <laughs> he said he broke the code. Yeah, but wait till you vid it. Wow. It's a map of the ghost jungle. Only the upper reaches. There are many other uncharted levels. But there's enough detail to show the location of this lair, directly beneath Sector Zero. 
It's a neutron emission map, so it had to be scanned from space. Which means Maximum has a spy on the orbital platforms. Mm-hmm. But all that's important now is to set a meeting with Dr. Jack so I can give this to Graft. What are you smiling for? If you give him that map, Graft will know where to find us. In old Nigeria, there's a saying. When the mouse laughs at the cat, there is a hole nearby. And you think you have a hard time understanding me? Hey, this place gives me a headache. <laughs> That's why I chose it. Your implants won't work in this environment, so everything I told you about how we cannot maneuver graft is just between the two of us. So what? Your plan will never work. Oh, that smiles. You know, I don't know why you're so against me, but if you want to see your buyout assistant again, you have to decide whose side you're on. Graf's or mine? Hey, the only side Dr. Jack is on is his own. Oh! Well, I can almost get to like that. I stress almost. Then tell Graf I'll give him the cylinder in exchange for Professor Archer only. You can work out your own deal to get your buyout back. Or have you already done that by offering to set me up in a trap? Blasted pad. None of this is any fun without you. Everyone is in position. Tell the doctor to start a little blue. Ooh! It's just not the same when I do it myself. Wake up, Phantom! This is your own private edition of the Dr. Jack Show. Since you can see what I see, you know tonight's guests are safely standing by for the feature attraction, and that's you! So, you law madman, it's over to you! Max here. Two hypercycles approaching from the south. Another step, and I'll detonate the cylinder. Relax, Phantom. This is strictly business. Now! Garan! Pull back! Oh! Ah! Everything is proceeding according to plan. That's how I do business. do business my way. But I was supposed to find you. Shh, my dear. Prodigal Biot returns. Identify yourself. I can't scan him. Get more Biots up here and... No! Well, Detective Archer, your first case is over. And I'm certain there'll be more. I hope I at least help you find what you were looking for. Now, what about you, Doctor? Your work's done, too? He's not going anywhere until you give me that cylinder. All right. Let us go and you can have it. No, Pavlova. I know now that I must create my own reason for existing. And where I'm going, you can't follow. What I've got to do, you can't be any part of. But what about you and me? I am not seeing this. We always have subcomponents. Now I'll always be part of you. Go get your buyout, Doctor. Heisenberg, wait! You forgot your brain. Now 
Now get out of here. I'm done with you. Till the next time. Yeah, I blame myself, Pav. I'll start reprogramming you right away. No. From now on, I will program myself. The birth of a new revolution, Baudelaire. Mother will be so annoyed. Hey, we had a deal. Deals? Are made to be broken. Going down. Grab the maintenance. In a few seconds, there's going to be a messy stain outside the main door. I want it to stay there. Hypercycle. Lock and find. Quickly! Well put, Baudelaire. My thoughts exactly. You put too much trust in your technology. What if the phase suit had not withstood Graf's weapon? But it did. And I put on such a great act trying to keep the cylinder out of his hands that he believes he has the real one. You see? The false map I gave him doesn't show where the lair is. Graf already knew the ghost jungle existed. He just didn't know its extent. And even though the false map will delay him, he will send a Bayat army in here to hunt you. I don't think Graf should depend on his Bayats anymore. I have a feeling life's going to change in Metropia. Faster than he thinks. I know just how you feel, honey. I know just how you feel.